My name is Giovanni Matteucci and I'm commercial producer in Italy. The use of artificial intelligence to jurisdictions and the likely possibility of justice have been studied with why for some years. In two different Italian courts, methods are being developed to predict the outcome of mediation in order to forecast which lawsuit already started can be resolved by means of an invitation or an order from the judge to the parties to revert to the mediator and then apply these techniques also to disputes outside the courts. Two main tools are available to Italian judges. An order to the litigants to undergo a mediation or and a solution proposal based on equity, which the parties are free to accept or refuse in all subjects related to alienable civil rights. The two options can also be used together, are then met. Kurt O'Barry, Judge Mirella Delia, considered the integrated conciliation in 2011, thanks to the following provision and the involvement of the local lawyers. The judge carried out in the adversarial proceeding a brief discussion of the main points of the dispute, considered, with the agreement of the parties, the advisability of starting a process of conciliation between or among them, read Article 185 of the Italian Code of Civil Procedure, recalled the new legal reforms of conciliation and mediation, asks the parties to file and exchange proposals or and tenders for the amicable settlement of the dispute, assigning a further term to hold a meeting with the assistance of the lawyers and possibly at the mediation provider, aimed at examining the transactional hypothesis, taking care to draft a written document to be deposited up to the 10 days before the adjournment hearing, and which may be taken into account as to substance when the costs of the proceedings are being regulated, adjourns the proceedings to the hearing, hours, arranging for that date the appearance of the parties before him her in order to be able to carry out in accordance with the cited article 185 and where still possible the judicial attempt at conciliation. Other judges joined the initiative, law graduates filed the cases on their results, the local forensic engineer commission took care of the IT issues. Outcome. 914 integrated conciliation resolution issued in 2016 up to the half of 2018, 414 of which were defined, 332 without further intervention of the judge, agreement or waiver of the dispute, and only 82 with a formal judgment. Updates to 2020 will be available shortly. A free online data bank set up with a selection of the delegated mediation ordinance and the agreement records, thanks to which it's possible to identify the main mediability indicators, a data bank shared by other courts at universities. University and Court of Florence, Simple Justice. In 2009, the University and the Court of Florence, together with other local bodies, launched the Nausicaa project related to the court order mediation with three targets. To offer information about mediation through a dedicated office located inside the court. To provide judges with young researcher assistance to identify disputes that could be submitted to mediation and to monitor could hold the mediation. In 2012, the first results of the experiment, 
If all parties were present in the mediation proceedings, agreement were reached in 46% of cases. Agreements outside the mediation framework were lies in another 27% of cases. In 2017, the University of Florence, Department of Law and Department of Engineering, and the Court of Florence started the Simple Justice Project, focused on good order mediation and the implementation of a predictive algorithm on the mediability of the judicial proceeding and the probability of the outcome. The project is based on the collaboration among young researchers judges and mediation providers and it is divided in four phases phase one analysis of the trial files by the researchers who selects the files draws up the wrapper for each file with information needed to assess the mediability of the judicial proceeding collaborates in the filing of data on each case in the computer system delivers the file and wrapper to the judge. Phase 2. Referral to mediation. The judge assesses whether or not to agree with the researcher's proposal. With the latter's assistance, he does up the order to refer the case to mediation, forwards it to disputing parties and sets the return hearing at the end of the mediation with a maximum of six months. Visit 3. Mediation Provider The provider undertakes the proceeding within the timeline set up by the judge to enable the parties to return to court with a result, successful or negative, already achieved. Every month the provider sends the judge data on the mediation carried out. Phase 4 Back to court. The judge reviews the results of the return hearing and assesses the effectiveness of his previous decision. If mediation not taking place, he may also order to revert again to it. In 2018, researchers analyzed 9,491 trial files. Selection on the basis of strict discount rules Files reduced to 4,373. Evaluation of mediability according to the subject matter and the stage of the proceeding reduced the files to 3,720, which were submitted to the judges. The judges noted legal reasons not to refer 1,679 cases to mediation and for another 745 cases that did not agree with the assessment of mediation. Therefore, 1,296 cases were submitted for mediation. Five mediation proceedings were 1,092, performed 756, not performed 271, not ended 65. Out of the 756 performed the mediations, 341 agreement reached 45%. To be noted, out of the 1,296 cases reverted to mediation, 577 43% were settled. The 6% of the originally analyzed files. The project also continued in 2019 and 2020, subject to the pandemic lockdown, and is already running into other cities. The Department of Engineering, University of Florence, is turning all the documents to realize the predictive algorithm. In relation to this project, the following have also been quantified. The social impact increased confidence in mediation by citizens and professionals through the number of additions 
of the parties to the judge's order to revert to mediation. The economic impact to the reduction of the average length of the trial. The impact on the efficiency of justice through the lowering of the judicial burden. The cultural impact trust in mediation in set occurs through the number of mediation orders issued by judges. The results will be published soon. Many thanks for your attention.